Okay, so how do you practice when you have a family, a job, a dog, and no maid, and you know, our lives are so full. And here's one thing is we don't have to do everything, right? If I if I'm running around and getting everything done and doing my best, I'm probably pretty uptight <laughs> holding on to stuff and I'm probably not a whole lot of fun to be around. So what really what I would really suggest first of all is five minutes of meditation, five minutes of stillness. It will give you a lot. Yeah. And then ask for help. Try to be messy. Try to be not perfect. And ask, say, hey, can I have help with this? You know, I think about, I have twin boys and they're 21 now. But, you know, growing up, when they were growing up, I still practiced. And they, they just came to know that was part of my life. I remember one time... We lived in an apartment in San Francisco, hardwood floors, really echoey. And I was practicing and my son walked in. He could barely, barely talk. And he had one hand on his hip and one hand pointing at me. And he said, stop it, mommy. <laughs> so, you know, he didn't always appreciate it. But, you know, they've seen that throughout their lives that I've still honored my career. I've still honored my talents and that they can do the same and so i can ask even a little one for help and sometimes it's it takes more work but you know it's more fun so am i worried about it am i uptight because i'm trying to do all these things or can i take five minutes to pause maybe sometimes it's one minute or 10 seconds just a breath and get some clarity so that I can go through my day in joy and peace and love, just taking in every moment. All right, so the, um, the challenge today, the action step is five minutes, five minutes of quiet time. You can do it. Do it early. Do it first thing in the morning. You wake up, go to the bathroom, five minutes of quiet time. Read something, something uplifting, five minutes of quiet time before you get on your phone, before you do anything else. Five minutes. And I want to hear how that works for you.